get any more pressure packed than this. The decisive game at the Euros with everything on the line. Which country will be crowned champions of Europe? It's going to be fascinating finding out. The story of the game as it unfolds, live next on EA TV. And this is the game we've all been waiting for. The final itself here at the 2024 UEFA European Championship. I'm Derek Ray sitting high above the halfway line and next to me ready to provide expert analysis is Stuart Robson. This should be fiercely contested. It's France against England. Well, there's going to be some nerves out there for sure, but what an occasion this should be. It's going to be tense, it's going to be tight, but it's also going to be dramatic. It should be a terrific game. Here's the side France will go with. Well, it'll be interesting to see how the wingers play today. Will they stay high and wide? Will they come in field and support the centre forward? And how deep will they come out of possession? They're going to be key to this formation. The England first 11. Jordan Pickford begins in goal. Kieran Trippier starts with Kyle Walker as fullbacks. Jude Bellingham starts alongside Declan Rice in central midfield. And the main striker today is Harry Kane. Now they're eyeing that final pass you just feel. Well, they couldn't keep that sequence going, unfortunately. France being afforded too much space here. And credit is due for that good piece of defending. Well, Antoine Griezmann really has emerged as one of the elite players in world football. Stuart, what do you expect to see from him in this game? Well, it's his ability with the ball at his feet that makes him such a good player. He can go past defenders with ease, he can play in tight areas, and he has that bit of trickery as well. I'm really looking forward to seeing him play today. Jude Bellingham. And Kane comes into the move. Good-looking attack, this. Well, it's no surprise that France are here in the decisive match at the Euros. It perhaps was to be expected before a ball was kicked in anger. But they have really delivered throughout the competition. And now they will want to make sure they take the final step. Well, for me, they've been the best team in the tournament. They've got good defenders. They try and dominate midfield. They've got some great attacking players as well. The manager knows exactly what he wants from the team. They've been here before. I expect them to be European champions. Corner kick played in. It might still be problematic. Superbly read and executed. Aurelien Chouameni. Now, what can England do from this position? Alexander Arnold. Really determined play to hang on to it. Walker. And the keeper has it after that tension-laden sequence. Well, what a great first save that was. How did he stop that? And Bellingham. On to Alexander-Arnold. Foden. Excellent defending. Griezmann, still pushing for the goal that would put them ahead, but not forcing it. Well, they were very patient, but they no longer have the ball. Harry Kane. And Bellingham. Attacking possibilities for England. A well, disappointing end to the move. Mbappe he's in here and pure instinct from the keeper well a top class reaction from a top class goalkeeper brilliant stuff yeah. 
short corner it is. The delivery from Dembele. And a struggle to get it away properly. Interception to snuff out the danger. Aurelien Chouameni. And here's Saliba. Griezmann. Dembele on the ball. Mbappe. And able to close down the shots. Trippier. Guehi. And now Stones. Walker. Stones. And on to Alexander Arnold. Walker now. Good use of advantage there. England moving the ball forward. What can they do from here? Alexander-Arnold well that's how to keep the opposition at bay Kane well, a promising looking attack but comes to nothing in the end Kunde. Stones, Guehi, and now Stones, Trippier, Alexander Arnold. Well, good run, this. Now, what can he do with it? But timely defending when it mattered. Quite happy to sit deep, but that can have its risks. Incisive pass. Very quick thinking there. And Bellingham. Oh, that's textbook goalkeeping. Now well, perhaps he thought he might escape punishment. Not the case. It's a booking. short corner Alexander-Arnold John Stones and on to Bellingham oh that's a super piece of defending Alexander-Arnold Rice well that takes the wind out of their sails great defending Aurelien Chouameni. Room to roam here for France. How about the cross? No well, advantage coming into play, and rightly so. Credit to them for winning back possession. Declan Rice Mark Guehi the referee has decided there will be just one minute of added time and with that the first half draws to a close
well underway once more and it's going to be fascinating to see what developments occur in the second half And France come away with it. Fine ball from Antoine Griezmann. Can he find the net? Oh, really commanding goalkeeping. Danger averted for now. Now, oh, can they hit them on the counter? And credit is due for that good piece of defending. Really doing a fine job of protecting the ball. Mbappe. And there it breaks down, but credit to the defence. Harry Kane. And England pushing forward with options available. Foden. Trippier. And quick thinking defensively. Using his physical strength to shield it. Going well. Just the challenge that was required. Alexander Arnold in a decent position now. Griezmann and back to Griezmann. And unfortunately for him, he had worked his way into an offside position. And I think everybody in the ground could see that was always going to be offside. And with play stop, they will make the change now. Declan Rice. Walker now. Rice with it. Well, this could be productive. Could cross it in here. Walker. Moving the ball more than decently, but can they take the lead? Declan Rice. Losing custody of it, Conte. Upamecano Dembele Mbappe with it Dembele cutting infield here Conte and back with Dembele well the fans want to see a shot Dembele textbook defending inside the box Phil Foden now Harry Kane. Aurelien Chouameni. France moving the ball forward. What can they do from here? And he did what he had to do defensively. Teo Hernandez. France really struggling to keep the ball. Bukayo Saka. Walker now. Saka. Well, very effective play in possession. He could pick out a teammate. Rice. Well read to ease the pressure. Keeping possession of the ball with authority. 
Now, oh, brilliant work to keep that one in play. Well, couldn't keep it in. There has been plenty of limbering up from substitutes. And now both sides will make personnel switches. Jared Bowen. Really good challenge. Promising move this from England. But the danger averted for now. 15 minutes left for play. And a good challenge to bring that attack to an end. Our play stopped. It is a free kick. Well, both teams have had substitutes warming up, and now both will rely on their respective benches. And the danger is averted. Phil Foden. And the counter looks on here, options available. Well, it petered out. And this pressing approach is working out rather nicely. Now, oh, doesn't get away with it, free kick given. Really good challenge. Ten minutes to go then. Tension building still level. Oh, good looking run. And they're breathing a sigh of relief. Ball one. Ollie Watkins. trophy well as you can see this is a great pass from Foden and the finish is just as good that's an excellent goal Well, a dramatic moment near the end, and that might well be the decider. Coman. Very quick thinking there. Declan Rice. Gordon. Goalkeeping. Well, he's just pulled off a great save there. Such good reactions. It really is. Time for a change then. Playing it short. Teammates in support. Well, that's how to do it inside your own penalty area. Coman. Griezmann. Rabio. Teo Hernandez now. Upamecano. Not getting it forward, but they need an equaliser. Just wasn't going to part with the ball. Two minutes of stoppage time coming up.
William Saliba. Now Rabio. Crossing possibilities. Hernandez. Well read to win possession back. And there goes the final whistle. England have won the Euros on this dramatic night here in Berlin. The joy, the ecstasy, also the disappointment, but ultimately the feeling of togetherness. Well, I have to say, they've been brilliant throughout the tournament. They were great today as well. They are the deserved champions, no doubt about that. And these are very special scenes that we're witnessing. And now with the pressure off, a chance to reflect, a chance to celebrate, the trophy about to be presented. The European champions, England! What a great moment for these players, absolutely brilliant. doesn't get any better than this does it a chance now to celebrate with their own fans and the fans have also played their part just listen to the noise here great end to this tournament <laughs> 